All right, so this video is going to be about how to use your Zoom audio settings so that you can just press and hold down the space bar on your keyboard to temporarily unmute yourself during class. You'll discover that during a lot of classes, the teachers automatically have the students muted because it's best for the background noise. It can be very distracting if all of the students have their microphones on because there's a lot of background noise that can make it hard for the students to hear the teacher or the teacher to hear the students. So it's very typical in class that everyone's on mute, but there will be times where you need to answer a question or you have a question for the teacher and you obviously need to not be on mute in order to be heard. So I'm going to show you how to use your Zoom settings to unmute yourself temporarily pressing down that space bar. All right, so the first thing you want to do is over on your Zoom screen, uh, down in that bottom left corner, there is that button for mute and unmute. Now you'll know you're on mute when you have a red line through your button. If you have the red line, you can't be heard. Right now you can hear me talking because I'm not actually recording this through Zoom. I'm recording this on my computer using different software. So that other software can hear me no matter what it is that I'm doing on Zoom. I'll give you a demonstration at the end of how that will sound with Zoom, but I just want to make sure you understand that when Zoom says I'm muted, why it is that you can still hear me. All right, so let's go ahead and do this. So the very first thing I want you to do is move your cursor right over here next to mute and see this little arrow right next to it? I want you to click on that. That brings up this menu and the item I want you to click on is audio settings. All right, so just click on audio settings. And what you're gonna see is that all of the settings for Zoom are actually going to come up, even though you said, show me the audio settings. What that does for you is it brings up all the settings, but it automatically puts you on this audio tab over here so that that's the main thing that you're looking at. If you wanted to change your video settings, then you could just click on that. But we said audio settings, so it brought us up into audio. So down here at the bottom, where all of these checkboxes are, you see this press and hold space key to temporarily unmute yourself. If that didn't have a checkbox, then the space bar method would not work for you. But we're gonna put a check there because we want it to work. And then you just close that window and now we'll be able to test that out. All right, so I'm gonna mute myself. So Zoom now has me muted. Again, you can hear me because I'm using some other software. But just watch what happens with that red line when I'm about to push down and hold on that space bar. All right, so I just pushed down and held the space bar, and I have been unmuted. Now, I'm still holding down that space bar. I have not let go yet. As soon as I let go, I'm going to be muted again. All right, now let's go ahead and do a demonstration of what that will sound like on Zoom. I'm going to press and hold that space bar. You can now hear me. I'm asking a question or I'm answering a question. As soon as I'm done, I'm going to let go of the space bar. All right, so that's how that works.